what's your conclusion? And yeah, good evening, everyone. And for sure, it was a thrilling game. Uh, two different uh, halves. The first half, as expected, we 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 knew that uh, West Ham were was gonna come with high tempo, with high intensity, pressing us high. But we couldn't deal with very well with that. We were not comfortable off the pitch. We had problems, uh, soft in duels, uh, soft losing some balls, and it was it was not easy. After conceding the first goal, we were lucky not to concede the second one. So that was probably the best part of the first half. And second one, it was completely different. I think that we came back. We showed character. We have made few changes. The players from the bench they had a very good impact, and we have seen a better a better team. So it's. Luckily, we can say that it has been a good lesson for in Europa. We know that this can happen, and now we are delighted to be in, in the semi-final. Marlon Uber, how about Sky? Is there a microphone in the very back? Thank you. Chabi, congratulations. Uh, what words did you find in the halftime in front of your team? Yeah, the players, they were well aware of uh, that. Our uh, intensity, uh, phys the physicality in duels, uh, our stability with the ball was not good enough. So uh, we have changed a little bit and we have tried to, to show character and to, hey guys, we, we can do much better than this. We need to, to, to show how we can play and how we can, uh, we can be competitive as well. And I think that second half as well, we have changed a little bit uh, the build up. We have put a little bit uh, higher Grimaldo, so we were able to, to build a little bit better. And through that control, we were able to, to deal better with, with the duels. And we start building the control. It took a little bit of time to, to score, but we were much more closer to, to, their, to the box. And we were not conceding, and we were not losing that many duels, that's, that many second balls. And we know that in that game, uh, West Ham, they are so good. They have very good players, and they have shown a very, very good intensity in the first half. So that second one. I am much more happy with that. Philip Ahrens, bitte, Bild Zeitung. Yeah, Shabi, two questions. Um, first of all, now you will face Roma again in the semi final. Um, what are your thoughts about this? And the other question is 44 matches now, European record. What does it mean to you? I know your records are not on your lists uh, every day, but uh, when they are there, you can comment. Yeah, for the first one, yeah, for sure. Another, we can say that we are happy that we can say that uh, we are back again in a Europa League semi final and we are again facing Rome. So uh, I think that it's, it's a different side. We have new manager, uh, he's having a good impact, the energy of Rome is good. But for sure, for us, it's, it's another. In football, you always have a second chance for, for everything, not revenge. It's just a second chance to, to do better and to, to try to beat Rome. But they will have time to prepare. But it's, it's going to be a really interesting and, and really looking forward to that semi final. And about the second question, yeah, the records are not uh, something that I like to think too much. But once you get them, uh, you try to to value them and to, to, to know that it's a consequence of uh, uh, many good things that we are doing and we don't want to stop. We OK, 44, but if we can make it a little bit longer, that would be great. And when in 10 years, if someone beats us, OK, let's, 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 uh, let's congratulate them. But at the moment, we are happy that we, we continue getting good results and having a good mentality to come back in the, in the tough mind moments as well. Yes, Hi, Sabi. Um, congratulations for going through. Sorry, because I'm not going to ask you about the match. I'm going to ask you, uh, you were part of one of the most dramatic shootouts in Real Madrid history. I don't know if you watched last night the, the shootout. What do you think? Did you celebrate it? Um, I don't know what, if you see it or not. Yeah, of course I saw it. <laughs> of course. I love, I love football. So and you, I love watching the quarterfinals of, of Champions League, of, uh, of Europa League, of any game. And for sure, you know, you know Real Madrid, uh, how, how the, the character they have, the, the mentality that they have, and in a very tough, tough game, they have already said, and at the end, they, they, they went through and to be, to be semi-final, and it's going to be an interesting one against FC Bayern. Christian Kremer, bitte, Kölner Stadtanzeiger. On this side, please. Uh, 
Um, Javi, uh, Odilo, Kosunu had a difficult day, a difficult start. Uh, did you talk about? Did you talk to him about the? Yeah, I talked briefly with him, but but for sure it was not a, an easy decision to to make a substitution in the in the first uh, in the first half. But he had the yellow card, and we were having a few problems. And and you know, uh, I had to put everything together. And sometimes you need to take action, even if it's it's not easy. It's not the nicest one, but. I think that uh, talking with him, uh, he will understand. I think that it's all for the for the uh, for benefit of, of the team. And and yeah, uh, one bad day and, and it can happen. It has happened to, to all the players, not just just to Odi. So all the players that we were struggling the whole team, not not just Odi. Philip Hans. Shall we? There were. Uh, some quarrels in the first half between the two benches. Again, it was in, in your back. It's, uh, uh, you didn't see it. Uh, for, but uh, do you think it was about what uh, happened in, in Leverkusen or? I wouldn't say no. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, please. Hi, Shabi. Congratulations for the win and uh, going to the semifinals. Sorry to uh, bring you back to last year. Uh, what do you think you learned facing Roma back then? And if there's any lesson uh, you can use in this new match? Well, in semifinal, um, the little details and everything is so tight. And, and for sure, we're expecting a very tight uh, semifinal against Rome, a, a team that they have great, great players and, and we'll have to be ready. But I think that the experience from last year, it, it will help us for, for the semifinal. Hopefully, that uh, we will use it in, in the positive way that we, we will be. I won't say that we were bad prepared, but that we can be maybe better prepared for, for the semi final because you need to know the moments of the game. You need to, to go through the difficult moments as well. You need to be clinic when you have the chance. And the second leg in, in, in Leverkusen last year, we were not clinical in, the, in certain moments. But let's see, let's see. It's, it's, another, it's another year or the season. Not other team because many players they are still in, in Rome. I know very well. New coach, and we have another team, so it can be completely different. The gentleman in the front, please. Um, Chubby, in terms of the you getting through, I think a lot of people, certainly in this country, thought, well, it's going to be a Liverpool by Leverkusen final. Are you surprised? A, that Liverpool have not gone through, but B, that all the English teams have gone out at a relatively early stage? Well, when we are talking about who's going to play the final before the quarterfinals, probably we are a little bit too, too, uh, too early talking. And so it's so, so, uh, so uh, tight, uh, so even in, in, in Europe, when you go anywhere, you go to Italy. We went to to Azerbaijan and Karabakh. We had it was really tough to to beat to beat Karabakh. So so yes, uh, you need to 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 be fully ready. And and to be honest, yes, it's it's not normal. But uh, that at this moment there are no English cups in any competition. Aston Villa, Aston Villa, no. So yeah, but that can happen. But anyway, the. We will see, but I don't think that next year will happen the same. I think that it could be uh, not an accident, but it could be just one year time. But you see all the, the English teams, and they have great players. They are so competitive, but it can happen because in other countries, we see in, in Germany, it's, we are happy that many uh, German teams we are we are going through. We are showing that the Bundesliga is, is so competitive, and in Italy, in other countries, so. All of them, they, reserve, they deserve where they, where they are. And, and uh, next year, it's going to be another, another one. Philip Ahrens, bitte. Uh, Xavi, um, how, na oh, sorry. how nervous were you in the first half? Because West Ham scored early and tried to nervous. make it hard for the team. Well, not nervous, but I was, I was worried because uh, the team was not uh, playing well, that they was not uh, feeling comfortable on the pitch, and they were were having problems. So more than nervous, I was trying to think 
how I could react, how I could make an impact in, in halftime, what, to, what uh, things to change, because during those moments when they were pushing, uh, it's, it's difficult to have a direct impact from the, from the bench. And I was more trying to think how, how we could do better in, in the second half and what things to change, but more worried than nervous. Philip Ahrens, bitte. Xavi, you just mentioned uh, the Bundesliga. You, as a Bundesliga coach, how, much, how important are these results from Bundesliga teams and European Cup competitions now? It's important for the prestige of the, of the competition, for the, for the level of, of the teams, of the clubs, of the players. It means a lot that, uh, uh, that we are able to go to Europe and to, to compete on the, on the highest level, for sure. It's just, it's, it's just semi-final, but it's not easy to reach semi-finals. So uh, all the teams are very good, and we saw yesterday the, both, uh, both games in Champions League uh, as well on Tuesday. I haven't seen the ones from, from Europa League, but all the teams, they deserve to, to go through because it's, uh, it's, uh, you need to put a lot of stake to, to, to deserve it. Uh, 